What was the reign of terror during the French Revolution? The French Revolution was a major event in the history of Western civilization. Beginning in 1789, the French people overthrew the absolute monarchy of King Louis XVI and brought about a republic that was based on the principles of equality, liberty, and fraternity. In general, the French citizens were fed up with the excesses of the monarchy, social inequalities, and growing economic hardships. As such, the revolution began as a movement that aimed to reshape the political and social landscape of France. In this video, we investigate a tumultuous chapter of the French Revolution, which historians refer to as the Reign of Terror. Let's explore this incredible event in closer detail. The Reign of Terror occurred from September of 1793 until July of 1794, and was a time of extreme violence and paranoia during the French Revolution. At the time, there were two main factions of revolutionaries, which were referred to as the Jacobins and the Girondins. The Jacobins were more radical in nature and promoted violence as a means of maintaining the goals of the revolution, whereas the Girondins were more moderate. Following the execution of Louis XVI on January 21, 1793, the Jacobins were concerned about threats to the continuation of the revolution. In response, the Committee of Public Safety was formed and led by Maximilien Robespierre. Robespierre, often considered to be the face of the reign of terror, was a member of the Jacobins and believed that extreme measures were necessary to protect the revolution. Under his leadership, the Committee of Public Safety implemented sweeping changes, including the use of the guillotine as a means of execution. The guillotine, a chilling symbol of the reign of terror, became the preferred method of execution. Thousands met their fate on the scaffold, including King Louis XVI and Queen Marie Antoinette. In fact, Antoinette was executed by guillotine in the early weeks of the Reign of Terror on October 16, 1793. The French Revolution continued down a violent path as the Reign of Terror grew and became even more extreme. Furthermore, the political atmosphere became increasingly paranoid, with accusations of treason and fear of counter-revolutionary activities leading to mass arrests. Friends turned against friends, and family members accused each other to avoid being labeled as counter-revolutionaries. The streets ran red with the blood of those who were deemed to be enemies of the revolution. This is also when Maximilien Robespierre began his own rise to power within France. For example, throughout 1794, Robespierre battled against others in the National Convention by questioning their loyalties towards the revolution. It is during this time that many prominent revolutionaries within the National Convention were executed for their perceived betrayal. For example, when Georges Danton, a leading revolutionary and popular figure in France, called for an end to the reign of terror, he was the next to face accusations of treason and ultimately the guillotine. However, Robespierre had begun to make many enemies as factions within the revolutionary government turned against him. His opponents accused him of abusing his power and carrying out the excesses of the reign of terror. As a result, he was arrested on July 27, 1794 and executed by guillotine the next day along with his closest supporters. Ironically, the violence of the revolution that Robespierre helped to inspire ultimately led to his own downfall and death. This marked the end of the Reign of Terror. The violence of the Reign of Terror left a lasting mark on French history, raising questions about the balance between revolutionary zeal and the protection of individual rights. 
Overall, the Reign of Terror was one of the most significant events of the French Revolution. It was originally carried out to stop supposed threats to the revolution, but ended up displaying the heights of violence during times of political instability. In total, it's believed that over 40,000 citizens of France were executed during the Reign of Terror, with many meeting their end by guillotine.